Hello guys, and today I have another commentary to share, and today's commentary will be on Inside Out Fan 2001's rant on Jonathan's Media Shack. And for this commentary, I'll not be alone, and today I'll be featuring three users, Colin Wood, Mackenzie Freeman, The Hunchback and Luca Fan, and Jonathan's Media Shack. So guys, would you like to introduce yourselves? Hi guys, this is Colin Wood, and today I'm going to help Scooby-Doo and Tom and Jerry Real Estate 2008 to do a commentary on Internet Out Fans rant on Jonathan's Media Shack. Hello guys, Mackenzie Freeman, The Hunchback, and Luca Fan here, and today I'll help Scooby-Doo and Tom and Jerry Real Estate 2008 to do a commentary on this rant video. Hello guys, Jonathan's Media Shack here, and I will help Scooby-Doo and Tom Dream Rules Details to do a commentary on Inside Out Fan 2001's rants on me. Thank you guys for helping, and anyways, let's start the commentary, shall we? Hey guys, I'm done with work now, and um, yeah, I just want to get out of the way. This here... There's a rant on a user that been commentary, been doing a lot of commentaries on my videos. The reason why he does commentaries on your rant videos is because they're meant for constructive criticism purposes only. And, yep, I'm leaving my job right now. Just uh, got out, so um, yeah, maybe back on track. Well, I just want to let this user. His name is Jonathan Media Shack. He keeps commentary on my videos so much and... Well, just like Scooby-Doo and Tom Jerry Rules 2008 said, he does commentaries on your videos for constructive criticism purposes only. Not for cyberbullying. It's just gotten really annoying to the point that it's becoming very mean and very mean. How does it mean? Can you explain why? It's spirited, honestly. And honestly, I just, um... The reason why... Uh, I just... I'm just so tired now because of a long day of week at work, guys. I'm just very exhausted, so I can... I'm trying to think about what to say, but yeah. He... It's just, um... The, his style of commentaries, I gotta say, are really bad. I, how are they really bad? Do you have any reasons on why they're really bad? If not, you're just making up excuses. I really do not like the style of this commentary video. They just, they really suck. They just, um... How do they suck? They just, uh, seriously, he uses a recorder instead of his own voice, honestly, and it's... Well, he can do that if he wants to, because it's his decision, not yours. It's just really, really annoying. Like... It's not annoying. Seriously. He talks like this throughout his entire videos. Yeah. That's what he sounds like. He goes like... Are you going to go into detail why you don't like this movie? Or are you going to give poor excuses why you don't like it? The reason why I said that in my commentaries on your rant videos is because you give all poor excuses on why you hate movies and you take the movies you hate way to the extreme. Yep, that's what he sounds like and it's just really annoying. It's not annoying. He says that for a reason. I, I just, I just, I, I wouldn't say too annoying, honestly. I would just say so boring. Yeah, that, that's the best way to describe his commentaries. There. Correction. His commentary videos are amazing. And as for your rant videos, they're boring. Not his commentary videos. So boring. They're so boring, so dull, 
and just um. How are they a doll? Can you explain reasons of why they they're a doll? I just do not like his commentaries. They just. I make commentary videos for constructive criticism purposes only, and you should know that by now. I just gain nothing from them. Yeah, you can make as much commentary as you want, Jonathan Media Shack, but I will never gain anything what you say, because you say the same crap over and over again. He says that for constructive criticism purposes only, and you need to act like him for once because you keep taking movies you hate way to the extreme. You keep saying the same stuff. And, um, and also, if you're a problem with me, you think I ship too much, if you think I have a crush on Joy, Vanellope, and Poppy. Well, it's true. You have a huge crush on them, but that makes you a pedophile. Well, guess what? It's fine to have fictional crushes on. It's there is no problem of having a fictional crush on a fictional character. Also, going back to what he was saying, what, what I was saying about the sort of um, uh, videos he does, like he always does uh, pictures of he uses uh, cartoon pictures to represent him and other users and. Well, he does that because other users do that when they make commentary videos. Like me. Also, the opening of his commentaries, they suck. They just, they go on forever and... How do they suck? And, uh, it's like, it's basically just uh, introducing the certain users on a certain commentary. The reason why he does that is because he features them in his commentary videos. Uh, that they would do, and um, and uh, they just have to have their turns to commentary and just rant on whatever I say in that video. And um, it's just, it's just really, it's just, it's really annoying. And it's not annoying, you man child. Just, uh, it's really dumb. Very dumb. How is it dumb? Do you have any reasons on why it's dumb? Dumb. Also, the images of the cartoon characters just get worse because it's always a certain character that's usually angry, honestly. You know? Because it shows of how angry I am. Just like how other users do that in their commentary videos. That and uh, yeah, his commentaries are just they're just really boring. They're just your rap videos are boring, really dull, very uninteresting to sift through. What are interesting to sift through, in my opinion? I will give this um, as much as I don't like Mackenzie Freeman's commentaries. At least Mackenzie Freeman at least puts the effort in her voice, at least. At least she puts effort, at least uh, she doesn't have voiceover. I see she uses her own voice, and she at least is expressive throughout her commentaries, and uh, at least they're kind of interesting to sit through. Well, that is nice of you, but you still suck. Unlike uh, Jonathan Media Shack's commentaries, because his commentaries are just so boring, it just, uh... Correction! My commentary videos are amazing! Like, uh, he's always talking like this, he always has a recorder, all the time. He can use a recorder if he wants to, because it's his decision. Yeah, it's just so cringeworthy, it's so cringeworthy. And how is it cringeworthy? Just uh, if you think I'm cringeworthy in this video, 